please. Your presence means I can count Eldrith dead. I am Mordok Selanmir. And you, you've been such a boon to my allies, who will be overjoyed to learn that they can begin rebuilding the Onyx Tower for their own. Now, it's only fitting that I offer you the hospitality of my keep in reward. I'm sure you'll find its dungeons to your liking. Seize them. Centuries of conquest and scattered settlements have done nothing to tame the monster-filled reaches of the Western Heartlands. Perhaps it is for this reason that the realm welcomes ambitious adventurers, and Baldur's Gate, its greatest city, calls to them like a siren luring mariners to their doom. Why do they heed the city's song, these brave and wandering souls? Some for the greater good, others for wealth, for power, for glory. Some do not know why themselves. This is such an adventurer's tale. Rumors abound of a dark alliance gathering against Baldur's Gate, of the hateful spirit of Eldrith the Betrayer, of a black tower of onyx in which she seethes and plots. Adventurers flock to the western heartlands to forge their destinies in the fire of battle. Even now, some make their way down the tradeway, moving southwards towards Baldur's Gate. Fortune favors the bold adventurer. Do not falter. That would be my last fight. I'm Ka'ira, a caravan guard. Not terribly, no, but I'm grateful for your concern. We were ambushed by the Red Fang Marauders. They took some of us away. Please, just lend an ear. Some of the Marauders took prisoners into the Trollbark Forest, southwest of here. But most of them continued southeast to Wayfork Village. They're going to raid it, or burn it. You must help, please. Monsters, brigands, mostly goblin kind. They've been raiding around Baldur's Gate for months. The city's soldiers can't find where the lot of them hole up. So, will you help? Then continue down the road until you see a path leading into the trees. It eventually leads into the Trollbark Forest. I'll meet you later in Wayfork Village. Farewell. Ooh. <laughs> 